In this video, I'll show you how to run Android apps on PC. If you find this guide useful, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go and consider leaving a like as well. And let's get right into this. The first thing you need to do is go into the description of this video or into the pinned comment, and there's gonna be a link called Bluestacks. So all you need to do is go and tap on it and you'll be taken to a website which looks something like this. And now you're probably wondering what actually is Bluestacks? Well, Bluestacks is an Android emulator. So what this means is we can go and get an Android device on our computer and we can go and use our mouse and keyboard as the inputs and then what we can go and do is go and play Android apps on this and I'm going to show you exactly how you can go and do it. So once you're on the Bluestacks website all you need to do is go and tap on download Bluestacks 5 just like this. Then the Bluestacks installer is going to download on your computer. Now, depending on what browser you use downloads may appear in different places. In Google Chrome they appear in the top right but you can always go and find your downloads in your file explorer in the downloads folder. So tap on file explorer and go to your downloads. So I just went and close off my browser and here I am in my downloads folder as you can see and here is the Bluestacks installer so all you need to do is go and double tap on it like so and you're going to go and get a Windows security pop-up in just a moment. You must agree with the security pop-up because otherwise you won't be able to install Bluestacks. Then all you need to do is tap on install on the Bluestacks launcher and then it's going to go and start downloading and installing. And after Bluestacks is finished installing it should automatically launch just like this and if it hasn't all you need to do is tap on the shortcut on your desktop or you can go and search your computer for it. And it's literally a normal Android device. As you can see I got this cursor which is basically your finger which you control with your mouse and of course to go and then run and play Android apps all you need to do is to open up the Google Play Store like so and the first time you open it up you are going to go and need to sign in with your Google account because that's just how it works. So find an app that you may want to go and download you can check out the charts or there may even be a specific game you may want to go and download which you can go and search for as well. I'm going to go and get the game Heyday so then all you need to do is tap on it then go over to the right hand side and go tap on install like so and now it's going to say pending and it's going to go and start the download just like so it won't take too long depending on your internet speed and just while this downloads if you're struggling with any lag on bluestacks all you need to do is go to the right hand side to the bottom right and tap on the settings or gear icon and wait for this to load and then come to performance and what you can do is actually go and allocate more cpu memory change the performance mode and basically go and speed bluestacks up if you're experiencing lag and if you're experiencing lag on your computer while using bluestacks then it may be worth low lowering the CPU allocation. In general, I wouldn't recommend using more than half your CPU or memory. And you can go and check how many CPU cores and memory you have on your computer by tapping on search and then searching for system information. And as you can see, I've got my processor here and I've got six cores. And then if we come down to my memory, I've got 16 gigabytes here, total physical memory. So that's all I need to know. And after it's finished downloading, it will then say installing and then we can go and tap on play. However, you can also go and play games from your home screen. So all you need to do is tap on the home button in the bottom right or the top left and here we are then as you can see I can go and launch Heyday from here and that's it we're now playing Android apps and games on your computer Windows 11. 